Helicopter engines are constantly challenged by a variety of airborne contaminants. These can lead to excessive maintenance costs and may also have serious flight safety implications. Particulate contamination such as sand and dust and foreign object damage constitute major threats to a helicopter engine. Due to the high velocities of the rotating parts, even particles invisible to the naked eye can cause severe erosion damage. The problem of engine contamination and erosion is at its worst when you operate from unprepared sites in hostile environments. The rotor effect causes fine sand and dust to be blown upwards, where it is sucked into the engine intakes. Snow, ice, hailstones and heavy rain can also cause severe problems for an engine. The maximum risk flight phases are when a helicopter flies close to the ground or during takeoff and landing. The pure air panel consists of hundreds of vortex tubes carefully packaged together. Contaminated air entering the tube is given a swirling motion by the vortex generator. Centrifugal force throws particles radially outwards to the tube wall. An outlet cone is fitted at the tube exit, separating particles from the main flow. These particles are scavenged overboard continuously with a small percentage of inlet air, while the remaining clean air enters the engine. Dust-laden air entering the pure air tube is given a swirling motion by the vortex generator. This swirling motion causes the heavier particles and water droplets to be thrown radially towards the tube wall by centrifugal force. The particulate and water is removed from the pure air system by an additional scavenge airflow.